I'm just wondering as an athlete, PJ, do you have that switch? What is your switch? That moment or that thing that you do that you feel and you know that it's really game time? I just love competing. <laughs> oh, really? What can I say? There's this, there's that is vibe. There like and, uh, we had a conversation with my coach and he says like, you suck at jumping and training. You really do. <laughs> and just like, it's, it's hard. I think it's harder for me to kind of zone in and to like, don't get me wrong, I train very hard and I think I'm able to train anything outside of, of, of pole vaulting itself pretty well. But when it comes to actual vaulting, it comes out in, in the meets, it comes out in competition where um, I, I somehow switch and um, get more focused, get later more focused. And I'm, yeah, I wouldn't say there's like a, like a switch, but Maybe the competition itself is a switch and yeah, I like competing with these guys. The years I've been competing in Europe definitely gave me the, you know, the the tools to sharpen myself um, in the day to day, like different variables in competition, different venues, different crowds. It's adapt and learn and compete. And the fun thing is like everybody's um, put in the same field, the same time, in the same conditions and let's see who wins you know what i just want to share whenever it's game time for me i i feel the the kilabot <laughs> when i wear my jersey most especially during the national team season when you wear your jersey it, it feels it feels different the fit the the when you see the flag it gives me goosebumps talaga. Parang, i think wow and yeah and whenever i you know, when you play for the national team, it's, it's just me. It's just, there's a lot of pressure. But you feel lighter with that pressure more than the pressure will bring you down. It, it feels like That's that. That's interesting. Because for me, I see it more as a privilege. I don't think that, yes. um, I mean, it, it, of course, it comes with a lot of pressure. But I see it more as a privilege to, to be able to wear the flag. Because... I think in, in the world of sports, there's like multiple things uh, that can happen. You're competing for yourself. You're competing for a brand. You're competing for a team. But if we dialed it down and just remember we compete for our country, and I think that is a privilege. And I think the moment I'm able to wear it again, I just realized, you know, this is not a given fact. This is something that I need to pay to be able to wear. It's the same, I, I, would, I would say for you guys, you know, you want to make the team you need to pay that price to be there in the team and and be one of those um, athletes who wear the Philippine flag on your chest. And I think it is still a privilege to, for me, it is a privilege to be able to wear the flag and be able to feel that pressure as well. Um, it's a privilege to be able to wear your your flag on your chest and be able to feel that 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 expectation, all that pressure that that comes with it. It's a privilege to be able to represent and the privilege to be alongside great and elite athletes as well, learning from them and show, like, showcasing also what we've got as Filipinos. Exactly. Wow.